Hurricane Fiona. First responders from our area are already on the ground in Puerto Rico getting ready to assess the damage there. And just moments ago, NBC 10's Rosemary Connors spoke to a Philadelphia Fire Department captain with Pennsylvania's Task Force One. That team is part of a national urban search and rescue effort who know how to respond to disasters all too well. I did Harvey, Irma, Maria. I was on the island here. In fact, I'm in the same hotel right now that I was here for Irma and Maria when they came through. And now Fiona, as Puerto Rico is barely beginning to pick up the pieces. What can you tell us about what's happening on the ground right now in Puerto Rico? Well, flying in, obviously, we got to see overhead. Uh, you know, there's areas that are flooded. You know, there's neighborhoods that are inundated with water. Uh, there is no power in the area that we're in right now. Um, the hotel's running on a backup generator. What is your primary mission when you get to a place like Puerto Rico? What are you there to do? My job will be to go into each of those um, the municipalities, seek out the emergency managers in those municipalities, identify any unmet needs, uh, uh, inf critical infrastructure that's damaged. If there's a hospital, does it need evacuated? Are they good? Do they have fuel? Don't they have fuel? What's the burn rate on their generators? Um, you know, do we need to rescue folks? Is there a bridge that's cut off? Things of that nature. And Mother Nature seemingly left no stone unturned in pummeling Puerto Rico. Captain Ken Pagora credits the Philadelphia Fire Department, which sponsors his task force with the outreach. They afford us the opportunity to go out to these areas that are impacted and do our job, uh, expand our toolboxes. And when we come back to Philadelphia, we have gained that knowledge so that uh, Philadelphia is better prepared in the event we were to uh, be impacted by, you know, a, an event significant in nature. What does it mean to you personally to be representing Philadelphia and Puerto Rico in their time of need? It's really humbling and it's an honor for me to be able to do it. To answer the call to help others. I'm Rosemary Connors, NBC 10 News.